Now, even after shifting to girls state basketball finals after last week's snowstorms, the UIL said that we needed to have high school playoff games every day this week in order to get back on track. I don't mind that. Now, that means both the boys and girls played a round on Monday and Tuesday, and they're playing another round today and tomorrow. And then, folks, they will get through yet another round on Friday and Saturday. And this was the place to be tonight. Spring Hill High School in Longview as 25th ranked Gilmer took on District 16 4A champ Lindale in the regional quarterfinals. First quarter off the inbounds, Madison Tate gets it back from Haley Jordan, splits two defenders and lays it in off the glass for the Lady Bucks. A little later, Tate is going to intercept this Lindale pass right here and she's going to head the other way. Defense turns into offense, sends it inside looking for Lele Morton and even though it gets deflected, look at the concentration by Morton to finish. That gets Coach Mandy Simpson fired up, but the Lady Eagles fight back. Brooke Everest with a steal of her own. She'll hit the short jumper right here, get it to roll in for two of her 10 points. Lindell trailed 22-11 at the half, but they valiantly got back into it in the second half. But Gilmer would hold on to win it. 12 points for Jordan. 37-34 to was your final. As for the fourth time in the last six years, they advanced to the region semis. Lady Buckeyes will await the winner between Melissa and Midlothian Heritage. Now, Lindell wraps up a great season at 24 and 5. Class 3A, third-ranked Winsboro, doing battle with Sabine Hay just down the road at Lobo Coliseum. Early on, Blair Kaufman gets it ahead to Haley Davis. She sees an open spot at the three-point line, so she pulls up there and buries it. She had 12 points, matching her jersey number for the Lady Cards. But here come the Lady Raiders. Lake and Allen with a well-timed lob to Faith Acker, who lays it in for two of her 18 points as Winsboro started to take command. Acker in the corner gets it to Shanda Davis. She sends it back to the corner to Faith secrets and she dials up long distance and connects. She pitched in 10 points for the Lady Raiders who led 53 to 14 at the half and they end up pouring it on. 90 to 47 was the final as coach Robert Cochran and company march on to the region semis. 28 and 2 Winsboro will take on Ponder or Reigns. They face off tomorrow at 6 30 p.m. The Lady Cards end a fantastic season at 22 and 3.